Good evening, everyone. Welcome to Copland on the Monday night. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, a relatively cooler and slightly cleaner air uh, for tonight. So I hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone had a good day. Let me see if I can queue up a video here. Or maybe not for today. <laughs> Evening, Kathy and Sonia. Evening, Anne. Evening, Nick. Hope everyone's doing pretty well. Good start to the week. Hi, Nancy. Hi, Joan. Hi, Linda. All right, let us begin. And hi to James. <sighs> All right, the Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we confess to you, the whole company of heaven and one another, that we have sinned in thought, word, and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins. Heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. And I will recite him 25. O gracious light, Lord Jesus Christ, in you the Father's glory shone. Immortal, holy, blessed is he, and blessed are you, his holy Son. Now sunset comes, but light shines forth. The lamps are lit to pierce the night. Praise Father, Son, and uh, and spirit god who dwells in the highest in the eternal light worthy are you of the endless praise o son of god like giving lord wherefore you are through all the earth and in the highest heaven adored it's the word of god um, let's start with psalm 4 Answer me when I call, 
O God of my righteousness, you set me at liberty when I was in trouble. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long will you nobles dishonor my glory? How long will you love vain things and seek after falsehood? But know that the Lord has shown me his marvelous kindness. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Stand in awe and sin not. Commune with your own heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of your righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart more than when their corn and wine and oil increase. In peace, I will lie down and sleep. For it is you, Lord, only who make me dwell in safety. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. And today's scripture... Read from Matthew eleven, twenty-eight through thirty. Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and will, you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And uh, I think this would be actually a good place, uh, since it's not indicated in the order, <laughs> this would be actually a good time uh, for us to take um, your prayers of uh, thanksgiving and needs. Uh, and so uh, I will start. Um, we pray for the safe return uh, of our troops from Afghanistan. Uh, and for the safety of all people uh, in the region, we pray for the people of Haiti. We also pray for those who have been impacted by Hurricane Ida uh, and for the entire region uh, in the south. We pray for all the firefighters, uh, the first responders, and the public safety officials working the multiple fires in California. I pray for um, quick delivery and adoption of the vaccine. I also pray for Marie's continued job search. Uh, it's been long, it's been arduous, and uh, we hope that there are um, some more leads that come forward. Pray for James and his family. We pray for peace and calm in Anne's busy life. For Gino and Laura and family. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, 
and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us asleep while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us asleep while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. Almighty God, by triumphing over the powers of darkness, Christ has prepared a place for us in the new Jerusalem. May we who have this day given thanks for his resurrection, praise him in the eternal city of which he is the light through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but, to del but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep, for you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Have a good night, everyone, and I hope you will do well, and we'll see you uh, later this week. Hope everyone does well. Good night, everyone.